20 votes are all that separate Melinda Katz and Tiffany Caban in the Queens DA Democratic primary. Caban's 1,000 plus vote lead evaporating Wednesday. A count of the paper ballots flipped last Tuesday's election night results, giving Katz the narrow lead and prompting her to declare victory. In a statement, Katz says she is looking forward to having the results affirmed in the coming days, saying, quote, I am honored to be ready to serve as Queen's next district attorney. But Caban's campaign claims the Board of Elections refused to count more than 2,000 affidavit ballots. Those are paper ballots used when a voter's name isn't listed at their designated polling place. Election officials say the ballots were invalid, but Caban's camp says it will challenge that. They said we could not win. But we did it, y'all. The razor-thin race is in many ways a fight between the traditional and the progressive, and the votes will determine which one prevails. Katz, currently the Queens Borough President, was endorsed by Governor Cuomo and the labor unions. Caban, a first-time candidate, received support from Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, Bernie Sanders, and Elizabeth Warren. Because this race is so tight, remember 20 votes is all that we are talking here. The Board of Elections rules uh, requires that this has to go to a recount. Reporting live in Long Island City, Queens, I'm Katie Corrado, Pix 11 News.